Good morning, girls. I'm getting ready to go to the dentist again. Hopefully, this will be the last of it for three weeks. I'm going to do, um, I don't know who makes this little palette. Who makes this palette? It's fell apart. I found it underneath a bunch of other palettes. Mm. I like to mauve it, mauve it. See, now this has essence. But I think this is ColourPop. No, it says essence. I'm going to just write, yeah, it says essence. I like to mauve it, mauve it eyeshadow. Okay, I thought this was ColourPop. That might be where my mistake has been this whole time. And I found this little palette under there, too. This is Eyeshadow by Dykalu. I might wear that, too. I don't know. Anyway, I've got all my uh, skincare on. And let's just... And that eyeshadow, that eyebrow pencil yesterday that turned red. Well, you know, I think my hair looks better pushed back. Let's push it all back with this, and we'll go like that because this is straight already. Renee's gonna take me. I was gonna go myself. I can do it, but nobody thinks I can. But I can. I've done it before. Anyway. So, um, I think that that wax I put on my eyebrows turned this brow pencil red. That's the only thing I can think of. This is the eyebrow pencil I've been using all along. I don't know. But let's put a little eyeliner on. This is ColourPop Cream Gel Liner in Sunnyvale. Oh, girls, let me tell you what happened to me and Brenda when we left. <laughs> when we left yesterday. Day before. Oh, I already told you. About her getting in the wrong lane. She's going for, um, she's getting another client this morning. But it's over in that same place where Shelly is on the third row of apartments. So maybe Shelly will leave Brenda alone. If she doesn't, she's going to be in trouble. Anyway, we have to find us a new friend. Now that we don't have Shelly, we got nothing. We got no, no Paris gossip. No Paris news. None. We got to get a new friend so we can talk about him. <laughs> we got to have something to talk about. Well, we probably wouldn't find another to give us as much to talk about as she did. And we don't really want anybody else like that. We want to go through that again. Okay. For my transition color, I'm going to use this real light. I have loved this palette because they're all about the hit, hit pan. So, uh, Renee came over last night. She stayed till 9 or 10 o'clock. We watched uh, TV. Well, it's not really showing up. Oh, yeah, it is. I don't want very much. I don't feel like putting a whole bunch of makeup on my face today, girls. But I need to because, you know, I need every bit of it. 
I need all the help I can get. And I'm using the Maybelline again. I love it. Okay, that's just uh, barely showing. That's, that's okay. That's what I want. Okay. Now for the um, crease. I'm going to use this uh, right here. Wait a minute. Well, that's pretty shiny. There's almost the same color over here. Yes, and it's it's matte. So we're going to use it. It's been raining all night. All night. And girls, I'm so proud of Sassy. She's just eating that dog food. And you know she wants those sausages, but she's being a real good girl. Mm hmm That's not too much. Just in that bone. That's good. Let's look. Oh, J.D., that's not good. You can't even see that. I come here. Well, now you can. Okay. I'm trying to quit making those faces, but you girls love those faces, so I don't know why I'm trying to quit. You don't mind my faces that I make. Okay, now what should we put in all over our lid? Well, this is kind of pretty right here. Let's see how flaky that is. It's not very bad. But that's that's kind of what we wore yesterday. We're not going to do that. Let's put this green in there. Or gray. It's gray. I'm sorry. Let's put that gray in there. I'm using the same brush. No, it's kind of dark. Well, I should probably have used that for my crease. Let's do it. Let's do it all over. And then we'll fix it. Yes. So, I've got several... comments yesterday uh one lady wants me to show how i do my skin i'm gonna put some of that in here don't i yes skincare and another wants me to show how i put on that uh, castor oil oh why what do i do different on this eye I don't understand. But I do understand that those don't look the same. Now, I'm going to put this lightest color. If I can get some out on the inner, inner eye. I may know that little man that, uh, Brenda's going to have. He's a preacher. And I think he preached at my church. One time. Might have been two times. Mr. Rhodes. And I'm going to tell you girls something I found in the Bible. I know you know, probably don't want to hear this, but... 
I was reading Hebrews, and I read about this guy named M Michel Zerzik. He was never born. He had no mother or father. They don't know where he came from. He never died. And he was Christ-like. And he was a high priest, but he had no family. Well, back in those days, high priests came from families. So then I was reading him, and I thought, i got to figure out who this is. I've never heard of this guy. Well, he's all the way back in Genesis, too, in the Old Testament, in the beginning of the Bible. He's there. And he's in Hebrews in the New Testament. I don't know who he was. I have never heard of him before. And y'all tell me if you've heard, heard of him. Because I haven't. And you know how I am when I don't know something. It drives me crazy. I've Googled it and everything else. And where is he now? He blessed Abraham. He blessed Abraham when his name was still Abram. I don't know. It just goes to show you, you think you know everything, and you, you don't. And why I never saw it before. That's enough of that. And that's enough of my story that I just had to tell you girls. I have no idea who that man is. I'm going to have to get a hold of Stacy. I bet you Stacy will know. She can tell me what's going on there with that guy. I'm not putting any more on. I'm just going to kind of blend it a little bit let it go. Uh, and I got on... Um, I watched this guy that goes to the, um, he goes to the pounds, the sh the animal shelters. And he sits with dogs and tries to make them feel, because, you know, a lot of dogs have just been through hell. People get them, and then all of a sudden they get another dog, and they don't want it. Well, yesterday, that's what happened. Well, there was two different dogs. One of them was starved to death, and it had a chip. Well, this is the second time they found that dog and took it to the pound. Well, now that people said, well, they don't, they just don't want him. And so he's pitiful. And um, his name was Bear. But you could see in his eyes, you could see his soul. That dog had some, it was part Doberman and he had those pretty looking color eyes. Somebody adopted him. He has a good home now. And then the next dog, he wasn't skinny, but he was broken. The dog was broke down. He was not skinny, but he'd been, he'd been abused. You could tell. Or she, she was a girl. And he liked to have never got to where he could touch that dog. Giving it treats and talking to it. And its name was Venom. It was solid black. So he named it Honey. Well, he liked that. He liked, she liked that name. But it didn't tell if she got adopted yet. But she'd been so mistreated, she was way in the back of the cage. And she wouldn't, she wouldn't budge. And I wanted that dog. Well, there's no telling what state that was in. But I wanted that dog. Can you imagine being in your home, being all comfortable, and the next thing you know, you're in the pound? And you don't have a family. And you don't have a home. It's terrible. Well, Sassy don't have to worry about that. 
says he's even in, in the will. She is going across the street to Scott's house. Okay, come here. But yeah, those dogs are so sad. And it's a good thing that our town stinks so bad because if it didn't, I'd be down there. You can volunteer. But no big dogs, just little dogs for me. And no chihuahuas. <laughs> Not them little mean chihuahuas. No, I don't want to. I don't want to be uh, trying to get good in with them. Them little dogs drive me crazy. But now cats, you know. But I don't think cats need people like dogs do. Cats are pretty independent, and they really don't care. But dogs, yes, they. I think dogs want to belong to somebody. Well, there you go. And Deborah sent me. She found that lipstick from Believe Beauty. She sent me two tubes. I'm so happy about that because I have been looking and looking and my Dollar General never has it. And I went to the Dollar General up on North Main. They don't have it either. In fact, they don't have any tubes of lipstick. Okay. You're showing out here, Jude. Just because you've started growing some hairs there. Don't mean you have to clog them up. Well, maybe it does. Okay, there. What's going on right there? Oh, that's good. Let's leave it alone. Let's leave that alone. This is Maybelline Sky High Black Eyelash Primer. Let me get a clean Q-tip and get this off of my face. Yo, Sassy hasn't even been outside. She can sure hold it a long time. Hopefully I don't come home and find it. But when she does have to, to pee and she doesn't want to go outside, she goes right up to that bathroom door in that other bathroom. And she goes right there. But I can smell it immediately. And she's in a lot of trouble when that happens. But not like today because she's not going to go outside. She is not going outside today because it is raining. And really, I have to get another animal. Somebody has to sleep in that bed I bought for Sassy. She's certainly not going to do it. And Renee thinks that she can put me a grab bar up. She probably can. Renee knows how to do everything. Because of managing apartments for so many years. Because that makes twice last week. Twice this week I almost fell in the bathtub. Okay, let's let's uh, leave that alone. Anyway. I'm going to put this away because I'm not going to ever wear that again. Let's just bypass. Oh, no, let's don't. I was going to say let's bypass all this, but we can't. We've got to cover that up. As best we can. I think when we get out of the dentist, there's a Mexican restaurant, right? Almost next door to the dentist. 
they have the best Mex real Mexican food. So I think we may we may stop and eat there. Oh, of course I'll have to tell them put my food in a blender. <laughs> Can you put mine in the food processor for just a couple of pulse pulsate it a little bit so it'll be soft. No, I'll just order something that's not hard. Oh, no. What's wrong with that light? This is Catrice Ultimate Camouflage Corrector in Brightening Peach. What's wrong with this light? Mm -hmm. Okay, it's little gobs of mascara. And I can't get it off. So I'm just going to leave it alone. There we go. You know, I've decided when I run out of this, I might get it again. I swore I wouldn't, but it's really good. Now, if my eyebrows turn red again, I'm not using that wax. Do I even have it in there? No, I took it out. But what? it had to have been the wax. Turn my eyebrows red? Oh my God. But another one of you noticed it. Yeah, I think that did turn your eyebrows red. Yeah, it did. So we won't be doing that again. We're not using that wax. But I really don't know how to explain the wax turning it red because that wax is clear. I don't know. I should have tested that out last night. Because now we're going in cold turkey today, girls, to see if it does it again. I put some on my hand, and it, it was not red. It was medium brown. So I don't know what I did. But it wasn't pretty. All right. That's not pretty. Look, that... Um, I have a circle around the tip of my nose, and, I, and today it is really standing out. Please quit. Okay, let's put on some foundation. I don't know how this color turns so pretty, but it does. Look at that. That's terrible. But it's beautiful. Yeah, okay, where's the hair right there? I'm gonna just. I haven't even tried to do it with a sponge or a brush because it blends so easy with your hand. Why bother? No, it doesn't make any sense. Oh shoot! I got more. Okay, I didn't get enough. Let's see. Oh my God, what is that? Girls. That giant wrinkle is coming back. Can you see it? I'm going to put my finger right where it is. It's right there. It's coming back. So, I'm not going to worry about it. And I told y'all yesterday that my husband's uh, fifth year of being gone was this month. It's not. 
his birthday is this month. He would have been 91 years old. Yes, he would have been 91 years old. Okay, let's get that blended. That's not looking too hot right there. Yeah. Come on back is all I got to say. There's nothing I can do about it. It's looking a little strange on that side, too. Oh, well, because it is. I don't know how in the world I went all these years without knowing about this foundation. Maybelline Matte Mousse in Natural Beige. I love it. Now, let's just do a little contour. Did I tell you about that woman I saw that, oh yeah, I told you, that had the imp cheek implants done, and you could actually see them? I'm pretty sure she's going to have those removed. She needs to. My mother had a, um, what do you call that, for your heart? I forget what you call it. But, you know implanted there and you could see it well why can't I think of what that was maybe later oh you girls will tell me I'm sure you all know but I know but I can't think but uh, pacemaker thank you Lord and you could see it. It looked kind of like a little pack of cigarettes. I don't know why I'm doing that with that, because I'd rather do it. Get this. It's a dark spot. It's not coming off, and it's not, uh, hmm. Well, here we go, girls. It's happening. No, it, it is a dark spot. What is that? Oh, yeah, it is. My God, there's two of, two of them. Oh, my God. I'm not looking. Well, you know what happened. I used that uh, Retin-A too much, and I used too often, and I used too much of it that one week. And then I had to lay off of it. Well, they say if you lay off of it, it all comes back. And so there it is. There's the start of it. Let's get some. Highlighter. That was uh, Catrice Shape and Define, but the the one I'm going to list is not this. It's got a new um, applicator, but it's the same color. The one I'm going to the one I'm going to list below. It's just got new packaging, but it's the same color. God, I hope I don't get red eyebrows again today. This is Catrice Sungasm. Oh, that's just it. It's Catrice Sungasm. Highlighter. Now let's put some blush on. <clears throat> I don't know what lipstick I'm going to use. That's 
let's do this. Well, there is nothing I can do about it. And there's a little one right there, but that might be makeup. Nope. It's not makeup. Well, I'm just falling apart. I'm just right in front of y'all. I'm just falling to pieces. This is Revlon O. What is it? Well, it's upside down. Oh, baby pink. All right. Well, we've come. Let's put some of this on our lips. I've got some um, anti-lip feathering in my Amazon cart, but it's not this. This is $27. I got the julep. And I got the sharpener so that I'll be able to sharpen it. Mm -hmm. No, we're not going red. No, we're not going red. We don't know what this is. We'll, we'll try it out. Okay. Let's get these eyebrows. Please don't be red. Please. I'm going to wipe it off. Please don't be red. Oh, good. It's not. Brenda has five dogs. She said that day that Sassy was over there, Sassy just played and played. She had such a good time. Thank God that's brown. Don't do too much. They're 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 pretty close. What does old Carol say? They don't have to be twins, but they do have to be sisters. So there are they're sisters. They are sisters. Now we're gonna put some lipstick on, and this is Revolution Makeup Revolution, and it is. Muted red. I thought this was muted rose. Girls, I think I've been calling this muted rose for months. Yes, well, I need some really good Mexican food. I really do. I don't like Tex-Mex food. I hate to sound like a food snob, but I can taste the can in Tex-Mex food. I just can. That's kind of pretty. Let's get in there. Get in there. That's enough, Joe. Don't get excited. Now we're going to put some powder on. So today, they're going to put them, they're going to put the wax in my, the wax cast in my mouth. And I will get to pick the size. If I don't like the size, I can pick that. If I don't like the color, jeez, dude, then I can have them change that. Or if you need more gum here, because you've lost some gum up there, and that's why I've got wrinkles way up there. 
So I'm going to try to get more gums in there and push those wrinkles back out as much as I can. But yes, so you basically, you're. I'm going to know what they're going to look like today. And they're going to be pretty. I'm not coming home with ugly teeth again. If my husband hadn't been dying of Alzheimer's, I wouldn't have never kept these. But I couldn't leave him. I couldn't leave the house. So, so I had to keep them. Okay. All right, let's spray. And after I get them, I'll quit doing this. That'll stop. Hopefully. If not... If that doesn't stop that, I'm seriously thinking about seeing if there's some Botox or something they could put in there to, to uh, make that quit doing that, to paralyze that. I hate to do it, but it is very embarrassing. Okay, where are you? Mm -hmm. Right here. Oh, still there. Anyway, I can't wait for the mailman to run. I've been looking for that lipstick for two years. I still have the tube, don't I? Ooh, what's all those little goodies back there? Well, well, well. Let's see. Yep, there's the tube. I saved it all this time. It is Believe Beauty Satin Crush Lipstick in Vintage Romance. This is the prettiest color. And I just, I want it. There. Okay, that's it, girls. Off to the dentist I go again. Thank you so much for watching. And uh, thank you, you new subscribers, yesterday. I love you, and um, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.